got some rusty old nail clippers you will need bicarbonate soda and some potatoes and some vinegar. So in one you put distilled white vinegar and then the other one you put bicarbonate of soda and the other one we put potatoes and why we are putting potatoes is because it has acid. Carbonate of soda, and we're going to mix it with a little bit of water. This is good! More water, more water. Take a look on our oven. It's a day after. Now we're going to scrub it with a toothbrush to see if the rust will come off. It looks like the rust is coming off. Vinegar, bicarbonate, and 
This piece of potato, we just need a bit more scrubbing. Yeah. This is the bicarb. You just can't get to the inside of it. No. So there is a bit of rust in there. But it did a good job on the top. The potato. The best, I suppose this didn't have as that, much. That is did, good. But this has a lot. Look at the water. This um, is the water. And that's the back one. Which is, I mean, it's, it's like an orangey. It's an orange yeah, I think color. this was the most um, horrible looking one. And this one was also pretty bad. But a good, the vinegar did a good job. Yeah. So I think we can conclude that vinegar is better. Vinegar was very good. That's my idea. Probably try vinegar and bicarb together as well. Add some potatoes, Daddy. Well, what's going to happen so if you put vinegar and bicarb together? Well, what, what I'm going to do no. is probably put that back in there. Well, All vinegar. of them. Um, for a little bit mm. more um, cleaning. cleaning. Mm. And maybe try the mm. bicarb. Mm. Joshua, would you like to? Oh, you have to get it somewhere else. It's going to explode. Come put the potato. Oh, what happens when you put potato? They're not going to do anything. I wonder you turn out potato. Please. What do you think is going to happen when you put bicarbonate in it? Okay. Cleaning. Whoa! Speed up that cleaning process. <laughs> See how quick that was? Yeah, yeah it went. That's is science. It?